Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video I'm going to be putting out a review on Heed Skincare. So I was sent these products about a month ago just to try out and see how I get along with and I've been using them every day because I wanted to give like a proper review about how I've been getting on with them. Um, so every day they've been part of my skincare routine and I've been loving them. So um, a lot of these products have been designed kind of like to help and protect and nourish um, exposed heads. So I don't really wear many hats or wigs throughout the day. I just as basically walk around as I am um, so it's really lovely to be able to take a bit of time in the morning just to actually care for my head specifically um, I think since losing my hair I haven't really shown it much love so it's actually been quite nice just to take a bit of time out of my day and kind of treat my head a little bit really um, and yeah I've been really enjoying them so I will talk through all four products that I have for you today um, just to tell you a little bit about how I've been getting on with them the actual use um, and just how I feel about them all really so before I jump in, um, I just want to say I apologise if the audio on this video is a little bit echoey. Um, we have just moved into a new house, so not everything's in its place yet, and also we don't have any carpets, so I'm still kind of getting used to the audio of this house and stuff. Um, so just a little bit about Heed skincare in general. So as I said, these products have been designed um, in particular for people with bald heads that are exposed throughout the day. Um, so I'll just read this off here. So Heed skincare products are designed to soothe, nourish and protect bald heads in particular. They contain purifying, hydrating botanicals. They are mildly scented with essential oils. Um, so as I talk about the individual products, I'll talk a little bit about the smells and things. Um, and if you're somebody that doesn't like something that's too scented and in your face, you'll absolutely love these products. They are very lightly scented um, and they're really, really nice actually. So I will just talk through everything I have for you today. So I have the four step um, head care range. I have the cleanser, um, the hydrating serum, the light and the rich moisturiser. Um, so the order they're used in is essentially you cleanse, uh, hydrate with the serum and then choose whether you want the light or the rich moisturiser for that day, just depending on how your skin is really. So I've mainly been using the rich moisturiser um, just because as we get into winter my head and my skin is generally a little bit drier um, but throughout the day if I feel like I want a little top up or particularly before bed I'll use the light one um, but in the mornings I've been using the rich moisturiser. So I'm just going to show you now the individual products and talk through how I use them and what I feel about them. So this one here is the cleansing head wash. So that's the cleanser. Um, this is 100 ml and I'll just read about how it says to you. So it says a gentle head cleanser to purge the skin of toxins, dispense a small amount onto clean wet hands and gently massage onto the scalp, face and necks and rinse off with tepid water. So another great thing about these is they're not just for your head, you can use them on your face and neck, um, which I have been doing, although I have had a little bit of an eczema outbreak, so I've been avoiding my neck a little bit, um, but I've been using it on my face and I've had no problems at all. Um, I haven't had any breakouts or anything, it feels really nice on my skin. So I've been using this every day for a month, and I don't know if you can see too well, but it's only kind of around where that green line is. Um, so a little bit of this goes a really long way. Um, and I actually have this in the shower with me. So I just pour a little bit onto my hands in the morning, pop it onto my head and then do the rest of my skincare after. And it smells really nice. It smells a little bit citrusy and almost like, I don't know if you remember the refresher sweets. Um, it smells very lightly like that, but the smell doesn't last all day. It's just kind of like, as you're using it, you get a nice little scent, um, but it does disappear quite quickly. So if you don't like lingering smells throughout the day, um, this will be perfect for you. So I really, really like this cleanser. It leaves my head feeling clean, but not dry. Um, and it says here, it's a gel-based formula that cleanses without drying or stripping essential oils. And I have definitely found that um, some cleansers I use, particularly on my face, Afterwards, they feel extremely dry and almost like I need to pile on the moisturiser, but this doesn't do that. It just feels really nice on my head. Um, so I highly recommend if you're looking to treat yourself or, you know, just look after your head a little bit more, especially as we come into winter months, um, this will be perfect for you. So that is 100 mils and it is 20 pounds for the cleanser. Um, just a quick note to say, I will be saying about how much volumes they are and how much they cost, but if you do buy the full regime, it comes in like a pack of four. They've got loads of different bundles on their website, um, but the full regime of all four products is 85 pounds um, and you actually save 11 pounds by doing that. So if you did want to try them all out together, then I'd opt to, instead of buying them individually, go for the pack because um, you do save a little bit of money also. So once I get out my shower, I go on next to my hydrating serum. Now, I was a little bit dubious about trying this because um, I generally avoid serums 
oils or anything like that because I don't like the feeling of something being sat on my head for a long time. Um, I spoke about in a previous video about how I tried castor oil and just stopped because I just don't like things feeling like they're sat on my head. But this serum absorbs so quickly. I honestly, I'm literally so shocked at how quickly it absorbs and how nice it feels on my head. Um, so this is the serum here. If you can see that, and it comes with a little dropper. I'll just unscrew and show you. So you basically just put some of the liquid up and then it drops out through the bottom there. Um, honestly though, if you don't like having things sat on your head, nothing to worry about about this. It absorbs so fast. Um, so again, I'll just read a little bit about how to use the serum and etc. So it said, heat hydrating serum penetrates the skin to rehydrate and support the skin's collagen, giving strength and firmness. After cleansing, smooth a generous amount into the scalp, face and neck and leave to be absorbed. I would say it's like 30 seconds to a minute maximum before this is completely dried on my head and it feels so nice. Um, this is actually out of all the products I've tried of Heat Skincare, my favourite one so far. I look forward to putting it on my head because of how it smells. It's very lightly scented but it's just so fresh in the morning it's lovely um and i only use two drops of this it does say to use a generous amount but i found that two drops is actually enough to smooth over my head in the same way with the cleanser um this serum goes a really long way and i don't know if you can see this um but you can see just above the green line that's how much i've used in a month um it's lasted me so long and i feel like they're well worth the money so this is 100 mils again, just like the cleansing head wash, both for 100 ml. And this one is um, 28 pounds for the serum, so slightly more than the cleanser, um, but I, this is definitely my favorite one so far. So after I've added my serum, um, I do add moisturizer. So I mentioned a little bit in the beginning about what one I use depending on what day, but generally in the mornings I'll use the rich one, and then in the evenings or if I want a little top up, I'll use the light one. So. I do get really dry head in the winter, so these have been lovely to try out. So I will talk first about the, I will go for the light daily moisturizer. So these are the jars, they come in. It is 60 mil and it says, um, the light moisturizer is for daily use. It's designed to be easily absorbed into bald heads. After cleansing, gently massage into the scalp, face and neck. So again, a little bit of this goes a really long way. So I will show you, because I haven't been using this as much as the rich one. This is how much I have left. I still have loads left in this jar and you really don't need a lot of it at all. Yeah, they've all pretty much got the same scent to be fair. It's very lightly citrusy. Um, yeah, just really nice, gentle smell. And these products feel gentle on my head. Um, as I mentioned earlier, I do have a little bit of eczema. It generally comes around winter times. Um, and yeah, I haven't found these to worsen it or not, nor have they improved it, but it hasn't made it worse. And I have to be quite careful about what I put on my neck because of my eczema. Um, although I have been avoiding it, I haven't noticed any kind of like worsening on my face or anything like that. So um, as well, if you have sensitive skin, it, I feel like you would be okay. Um, but if you do have really sensitive skin, then I'd recommend just dropping them an email just to check that they'd be all right for your skin type. But I've had no problems whatsoever um, with this. So the Light Daily Moisturizer has vitamin D and E, and both the Light and the Rich Moisturizer are 24 pounds, and you get 60 ml in the glass jar. They feel really good quality, and this is going back a bit, but just to talk about this cleansing head wash quickly, because this is something I really did want to mention. Um, I've had this in the shower with me for the last month, and look at the quality of the label. It's been, I've been using this with wet hands and it's been in my shower and it hasn't peeled or anything. The quality of these jars and the labels are insane. Like, considering that I've been, had them in the water for the last month, they, haven't, they look like they're brand new. I'm really, really impressed with the packaging, actually, and it's so nice having... Can you hear that? Glass jars as well. It just feels like really nice quality. Um, anyway, I digress. <laughs> so that was a little bit about the light daily moisturiser. So finally, I just want to talk a little bit about the rich moisturiser. And this is the one I have been using the most of, so I've used a little bit more of it. Um, so I'll just read out how to use it. So the rich nourishing moisturiser is skin nourishing, hydrating moisturiser for tired and damaged skin, especially on bald heads. In the evening after cleansing, gently massage into the scalp, face and neck. Use also after gentle cleansing following sun exposure. So I'm actually going on holiday 
early next year and this is coming with me. <laughs> I really like, and as well, similar to the um, hydrating serum I've got, it absorbs really quickly. In the same way with um, putting like oils and serums on my head, I normally avoid because I just do not like things sat on my head. Um, these absorb really quickly and they just feel like your head is so soft. And um, for me as well, take, I think for a little while when after losing my hair, I kind of like, avoided looking at my head or like doing anything with it and for a time as well I avoided putting on wigs just because I didn't really want to kind of like look at it or deal with it in a way but it's been really nice just setting aside some time to give my head a little bit of love in a way um, in the same way I do with my face and the rest of my body it's really important I think to take a little bit of time for like self-care and these really are a perfect way to do so especially if you do have head that, uh, skin on your head that's exposed I highly recommend these products I've been really really enjoying them um, so yeah the rich one is one of my favourites out, the moisturiser, although my favourite item out of all of them is definitely the serum. Um, I just can't believe how quickly it absorbs and how nice it is on my skin. Um, so just quickly, the Rich um, moisturiser, um, again, 60ml and £24, I think I've already mentioned that. Um, so yeah, just overall thoughts really. First of all, thank you to Heed for sending me these because um, it's something that I wouldn't, I've seen online before but I hadn't really opt to purchase just because I don't know I just hadn't really but to being able to actually try them um, I cannot recommend these products enough and how long they are lasting as well so although the price point is slightly higher than kind of like um, ones you can buy on the shelf they last so long a little bit goes a really long way and because they're specifically designed for heads um, you just know that what is being put onto your head is protecting and it just feels so soft like my head just feels really like nourished and moisturized and I do really suffer in winter with dry skin. So if you are thinking about um, trying some of these out, whether it be for yourself or a gift for someone else around Christmas time, um, definitely check out the website. So I do occasionally have offers on with like discount codes and things. And I highly recommend as well, um, I would try out the full bundle, the full range. Um, you do save a little bit of money rather than buying individually. And um, if anything out of all of them, try the serum. Um, I am absolutely loving it. So that was the full video. I will insert a little clip of me just um, kind of like I'll record in my bathroom just of me applying these products just so you can see roughly how much I use and how I do it and um, just in case you're interested in how I apply them. Um, but otherwise, thank you so much for watching and I will link below Heat Skincare's website and Instagram if you want to check them out. Um, make sure to, you do give them some love and um, yeah, thank you again for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!